Hey y'all, it's Jacqueline. We are at the end of another month and you know what that means. It's another month's favorites. So obviously this month is very special because it's the end of 2014. We're turning over and starting a new leaf. Uh, we just had Christmas. I hope everyone's Christmas was super lovely and you had a wonderful time. Um, some of my favorites are new items and uh, some of them are just old ones that I've really fallen in love with this December. So stick around, I hope you enjoy my December favorites. My probably most favorite favorite, and this is a new item, I got it at the beginning of the month, is my new laptop. And it is an HP Stream and I adore it, adore it. Um, super thin, super light, just super easy to carry around, um, editing, uploading, everything. I don't know what the price is right now, um, but before Christmas, Walmart had these on sale for $199. That is an amazing deal for a great laptop. Um, they also come in blue and pink, but I preferred just the standard silver. Um, so I will try to find a link down below to a good deal. If you're interested in getting you a new laptop, I highly, highly recommend this. Now, like I said, since this is December, everything this month is very wintry um, associated. Everything to keep me warm and cozy and soft all winter long. Uh, so my next favorite is my coat. And coat slash jacket, I don't know but it is my Columbia and it is just the softest, sweetest little thing ever. Um, it's even warm enough to ski in because it has the Omni heat, um, which it's like a little microwave on the inside. It traps your body heat, so it doesn't have to be very big and puffy to actually create a ton of warmth. Um, but oh, I just, I love it so much. Love it, love it, love it. It looks super duper cute on. And it's just an adorable white fuzzy coat to get me through winter. It's not super dressy. I have nice dressy coats that I can wear for like dinner and nights out and things like this. This is a good day-to-day -day utility coat when it gets really cold outside. My skin gets so dry in the winter. It is just sad. My face gets really dry. My hands, my elbows, everything. It's disgusting. Um, so I have to take a lot of precautionary measures during the winter to keep my skin nice and soft and supple. And I'm going to share some of those with you guys today. So three of my favorites right here. Just my good old standby. I actually use this all year long, but in the winter it really, really comes in handy. And it's just Johnson & Johnson's baby oil. Although I tend to get the green bottle, which is the aloe vera one. It is super moisturizing and has a really fresh, clean scent. It doesn't have that kind of baby oil scent. You don't want to smell like a baby. You just want to smell fresh. Um, during the summer, it's awesome. It gives your skin, like your tan, a great glow. But during the winter, oh, it just so up all the moisture your skin needs and I don't have to put any lotion on all day if I put this on while I'm in the shower. Highly recommend you get on the baby oil. My next two are for keeping my skin on my face nice and non-flaky and the first one's a mask and I just I mean how often do you see like a moisture mask? They seem to be a lot more rare than like your typical more drying exfoliating masks. Um, so I just adore this one and it's by Kors and if you have any Kors products then you understand that like everything on their bottles is in Greek. Uh, so I will try to interpret it. <laughs> um, it's a yogurt mask, okay, so that's the name, yogurt mask, velvety moisturizing mask for oily and dehydrated skin. That doesn't really make sense, oily, dehydrated, I don't know. All I know is that it moisturizes beautifully. Oh, your skin just soaks it up and it just leaves your skin so soft and supple. Um, so if you want a little look at it, here you go. So it's Kors Yogurt Mask and that's all the details that are non-Greek on this bottle. My heaviest moisturizer that I use pretty much only in the winter, it is way too heavy any other time of year. And that is the Benefit um, Total Moisture Facial Cream. And it's in these, I love these bottles. Do you guys have some? Um, they have a whole line of like, uh, I had the eye makeup remover, they have some, the It's Potent comes in this with like the, the cork and then the gorgeous blue glass. It looks very retro. Oh, I just adore it. I initially bought it because I just thought this line was so gorgeous to have on your counter. But then I discovered this cream is just the thickest. I mean, look at that. It is just luxuriously thick and it lasts so long. I mean, look, I haven't even gotten below the rim. And I've had it for like a year. 
that's what I mean. But I also, like I said, I only use it in the winter time. Um, but if you're looking for an extremely heavy, emollient, super duper moisturizing face cream, this is a great way to go. Book of the month. This book, oh my gosh, I have just been devouring it. I got it for Christmas, actually. Santa Claus bought it for me. It was in my What I Got for Christmas haul. And I just started it two days ago. And as you can see, I'm halfway through because I have not been able to put it down only when absolutely necessary. Um, it is by Holly Chamberlain, which is not an author that I've read from before, but if you look in the book, she does have quite a few other uh, titles. And thinking about checking them out, I really do like the way she writes. And it's called One Week in December. And it's just a great story, and it's not the typical stories that I gravitate towards. Um, this one's a lot more dramatic, family secrets, secret adoption, um, yeah, just, just the secrets that families can hold. And it's all about dealing with that during Christmas time. So this last item, I just got so lucky. It's a pair of boots, and as you can see, I mean, they're super cute, um, like super worn and old. Um, <laughs> this is probably not everyone's style but I just adore them. Um, I love them in place of a riding boot. Um, the riding boot is just so overused. These are just so much more special. It, it almost resembles a cowboy boot, almost resembles a work boot, um, but they're just so soft and they button all the way up and you can leave like three unbuttoned and it looks really, really cute. And this brand, oh my goodness, oh my goodness. Okay, Fiorentini and Baker. See? Fiorentini and Baker. So legit, legit shoemakers. I found them at a thrift store, paid 20 bucks for them. I go home and Google them, and I was not able to find this exact um, model. And because I obviously, I mean, these could be 10 years old, who knows? Um, but I, I wasn't able to find this exact style. But the styles that I saw similar to this go anywhere from between $300 to $500. So I was just so floored that I got these for 20 bucks. And as always, I have to have a Bible verse for you guys for the month from my YouVersion Bible app. Um, this one was from Christmas Eve, and it's such a beautiful verse I had to share. Um, so so this is from Luke chapter 2 verses 13 through 14 and again if you want to hear the entire story of the birth of Jesus Luke is the best chapter for that um, so here we go suddenly a great company of the heavenly host appeared with the angel praising God and saying glory to God in the highest heaven and on earth peace to those on whom his favor rests and it's just such a beautiful verse about Christmas and, and the reason for Christmas. And I want you to remember that all of us, no matter who you are, whether you believe or you don't, you are blessed. You are loved. If you have any questions if, about anything that I got, just let me know in the comments down below. Um, if you like it, give it a thumbs up. And also, if you haven't already, please hit subscribe and stick around for more videos and fun that we have here on my channel. I would love to have you stay. Um, and if you'd like to follow me elsewhere, I am at Fort Worth Famous on everything. Twitter, Tumblr, Instagram, everything. So yeah, I hope you guys had a beautiful Christmas and I'm wishing you the best in 2015. I can't wait to see what this future year holds. So excited. Love you guys so much. Bye y'all.